When you look at the bottom of a fig, you'll find a tiny hole. This opening is called an osteol. We established that the fig flowers are hidden inside of the syconium. But for the flowers to be fertilized, they first need to get pollinated. So how do they get pollinated when no pollinators can get to them? When female flowers enter maturity and they are ready to receive pollen, they produce volatile attractants, chemical signals to the wasps, that they are ready to receive them and get pollinated. So when the right species of a wasp is around, it's chemically drawn into a fig. But there is one problem. How does it get in? During flower development, the osteol is tightly shut by overlapping bracts. But when the female flowers become receptive, the bracts loosen up, making it possible for the female wasp to enter the fig by pushing through the scales. Once the female wasp is successfully in the syconium, her main task is to lay eggs. She lays her eggs in the ovaries of the female flowers. The wasp crawls over the female flowers and at each flower she inserts her ovipositor into a style, releasing an egg into the ovary. While doing so, she also releases the pollen that she carries on her body, often in a pocket on her thorax, depositing it on the stigmas.